Play English. Yep, I'm playing in this game in English. Hello there. It's very so very nice to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My new let's play is a Pokemon game, baby. Been a while. My name is Wowen. However, everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. This is world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. And to the much slacks! Woo! It looks like you are. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together, and at other times we walk together. Some po some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. What do I do? I conduct research so that we may learn more about Pokemon. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Anyway, anyway, this game new game features uh, customization and all that. So yeah, we can play as a girl or a boy. Uh, I'm not actually playing as a girl in this game. Like I did my uh, I did my regular playthrough as a boy, of course, because by the way, I'm gonna play as a girl. As a girl in this game, you know, sometimes you always like to you know change stuff up. Let's play as Dawn. I mean, but we're not gonna be called Dawn, of course. We're gonna call Cobra or Miss Cobra, I guess. It's called, I'm just doing Cobra though, not Miss Cobra though. <laughs> I could to totally do Miss Cobra. Your name's Cobra. Yes, it is. Because that's, it's a let's play, of course. Oh, so you're Cobra. A fine name that is. Now, this boy here, I believe he's your friend. What might his name be? Blonde hair? Barry, Damien, Tyson, or Marcus? Interesting choices. I knew Barry was on there, but because he's normally. Um, I'll tell you. And you can also name your Wowl. Who should I name the Wowl be? Hmm. <laughs> I doubt. Thing is, this is Generation Four, and also we make so I doubt you can do you know bad names in this game because you know it's well, it, it's not a Gen One game. But and also he's not a smart ass like the Gen One Wowl is. So let's name him. Hmm, let's name him Gator. Gator, later Gator to you. <laughs> I wonder who's watching this. Gator it is. That's your friend's name. Yes, it is. All right, Cobra, the time has come. Your own tale of grand adventure is, is about to unfold. On your journey, you will meet countless Pokemon and, peop and people. I'm sure that along the way, you'll discover many things, perhaps even something about yourself. Now go on and leap into a world of Pokemon. Oh, yeah. But welcome to our new Let's Play of Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Yes, Brilliant Diamond. Not Platinum, not Emerald, but there's this cutscene right here, of course, about our red Gyarados and like that, that has just appeared out of nowhere. With the weapon, it's actually a weapon to Generation 2, actually, by the way, but... Man, this is gonna be a fun Let's Play, though. Like, it really, it really is. And I, I guess that, that concludes our special report. Search for the red Gyarados. Brought you by Drew Live TV on na Nationwide Net. See you next week, same time, same channel. But anyway, God, look at this! Look at this! It's so cute! Oh my God, Don, that looks kind of cute. I love this style of game that we make. It's pretty great. I do not. I can't believe I'm back here in Sinnoh again, man. Again, and like I said, I already did a, pl a full playthrough of this game and everything on my own. But this is actually the final let's play. Look, we can go to bed too. We can sleep on this. We can amazing. But, uh, is there anything, this is our, we also got our Nintendo Switch and all that. It's the latest console, a Nintendo Switch. Get anything on our PC, because that's what we always do when I check in a Pokemon game. Did we get it? Oh, let's see. No, there's nothing on my PC, but there's a TV. But yeah, this is Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Been a while since I did a Pokemon Let's Play. But, and I know I decided to do Platinum. Not, I decided to do this game. Hold on, I'll tell you a minute. Come on, Gator, call, call calling for a little while ago. I don't know what it is about, but he said it was an emergency. But yeah, okay, Gator called me. Oh, there's Chansey on the TV. But yeah, like, I've been wanting to do a Let's Play of Pokemon for a while. Oh yes, Koba, don't go into the tall grass. What Pokemon may attack you? It would be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't, so... Oh, but yeah, but it's been, it's been a while since I've done a Pokemon Let's Play. It has been a while. It's been like five years or so since I've done a Pokemon Let's Play, or well, a full-on regular Let's Play and all that, at least, because Tick Light sort of did Fire Red. Driving as a Nuzlocke, but I mean, that was different and so I never actually completed this, that, so anyway, let's talk to this guy over here. Technology just blows me away. 
I mean, now you can play with people around the world wirelessly. Yeah, that's why this game introduced was wireless. This is amazing when you think about it. Anyway, we, anyway, we, this is our, I think, our friend's house, right? Yep. Dog. What was that about? Oh, hey, Cobra. I'm going to the lake. You should come too and be quick about it. Oh, okay, Cobra. I'm finding you one million Poke Dollars if you're late. Oh geez, forgot something. What did you forget? Let's see what let's see what he forgot. Cause I think we can go anyway. We can talk to his mother. What's his mother say? Yeah, okay, he's just talking about Gator. Okay. Do we do we have to go up here? Sometimes I always forget like exactly where yeah, we need to go up here. It it better take it better take my bag and guidebook too. Oh hey, Cobra! We're going to the lake. I'm waiting on the road. It's a 10 million fo- I thought it was 1 million, dude! God, Gator. Your money. I mean, I mean, he's the- he does- the, he's- he's the one that's- he's the guy that's doing the Disney program. So he has the money to do that. So, you know, you got that. <laughs> but he has plenty of money now. He, I, don't, I don't know. He's doing the Disney college program so he has money. <laughs> no, not necessarily, but... I mean... I wish I could do the Disney program as well, but I don't know. I mean, I probably could have, but I just never, never knew about it. Hey, you saw that news report that was on TV, right? You know, search for the White Gyarados, the mysterious appearance of the Furious Pokemon in LA, in the in LA, Furious. So like, I'm saying furry, not furious. That sure you got got me to thinking. I'll be, bet our local lake has a Pokemon like that in it too. So that's what we're gonna do. We'll go find a Pokemon like that. Let's do it. I go this way though. We had to go this way because this is where we actually get our. This is actually to Rory Lakefront. Because I believe this is where we get our, our Pokemon too, right? All right, to the lake. Let's find the Red Gyarados. Thing is, it's not even in this game. It's in uh, Johto. What's or in Heart Gold Silver or the Red Gold Silver or Crystal? What's going? What's going on, Professor? There. The, professor, there's nothing out of the ordinary the other side either. Hmm, I might have been mistaken. I need to do the voices. I'm gonna do a change of voice, sorry. Something appears to be different than it was before, but fine, it's enough that we have seen the lake. Lucas, we're leaving. P professor, you've been gone for years now. How are you enjoying being back in Sinnoh? Huh, there is one thing Harry can say. There are many rare kinds of Pokemon in Sinnoh. Regions should serve us very well in regard to our studies. Excuse me, let us pass, please. How rude that guy is. Sorry, Fox! What was that all about? Those two? Huh. Cobra, let's go check this out. Da 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 da. What's that? Don't go into the tall glass. No problem, no problem. We won't be in there long enough for Wild Pokemon to come out. <laughs> let's make our story, baby. It's a briefcase. Those Pokemon po people forgot it here. How dare they? What are you supposed to do with it? We can try to return it, but who they, were they? I heard they say, Professor? It's Starly attacking us! What's going on? <laughs> I love my voice though. Alright, look, look, these are Pokemon Pokeballs. Let's battle using the Pokemon in them. Which one do you want then? So we got three choices. We got either to trick the tiny Pokemon. Yes, no. We got uh, Chimchar, the Chimp Pokemon, maybe. Or we got Piplup, the Penguin Pokemon. Oh, the Penguin, we're, we're, the Penguin Pokemon, Piplup, sorry. You know, you know, the, you know what the thing is, I did Piplup, I did Piplup in my normal playthrough. But I also did the, I also did a uh, Chimchar in my Platinum Let's Play. So I could pick, I could pick Turtwig, Turtwig, but we're gonna pick Chimchar. 
Cause you know it's because there's no there's no fire Pokemon. There's barely any fire Pokemon in the game. There's barely any fire Pokemon in the game. So I'm gonna pick Chimchar Pokemon. And Chimchar is the best. He really is. Ooh, what we got? Got a Starly. Well, we don't. Well, we don't. We're not gonna catch Starly, but because I'm gonna try to have a different, different member of my team. So we got Chimchar and like welcome to the Pokemon Battle. We only got Leave and Scratch, right? And Liz can press the Y button to see what it does. And that lowers the defense as well. And wait, is it? yeah, it lowers the defense, but also this. Let's actually lower the defense. And then they got scratched. That's just a little damage. But I love this music though. See, that does lower its defense, so you know we can attack it better. How much damage that you do? Ooh, that four. Let's see how much scratch does on it. Can we? I think we actually can, like you know. Oh, that did almost the full damage. Damn. <laughs> I don't think so though. And then scratch again! And we defeated the Starly. Unless somehow it. it yeah, I knew it faded. <laughs> Imagine it left and it not faded. Gain experience points and everything. Nice. Ah, your Chimchar totally rocked! But my Pippa was, was way tougher than. It. Because it's water type, of course it is! Gator, golly! See, this thing, he just exactly acts like Gator. He doesn't know the difference between type matchup, between fire and water. How dare he! There were other people's Pokemon, but we had to use them. This po po people won't mind, will they? There's Lucas. Whoa! You found the briefcase. The professor would gone through the roof if he knew I forgot it here. Hmm. What? Did you guys, did you use these Pokemon? Oh man, how am I gonna explain this to the professor? This is the professor's briefcase, so I'll take it, okay? Man, my voice is kinda tiring, actually. <laughs> what was that all about? I don't know what's going on, Cobra. Let's get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from the battle. If we get attacked by another Pokemon, we might be in trouble! Oh man, I love I love well I love platinum, but it's brilliant diamond. I keep saying platinum, but like it's brilliant diamond. You go ahead! I know we had had to go return these Pokemon, they're not ours. But I want to spend just a little more time with this little guy. I do too. Anyway, let's go forward. I didn't even my voice though, I really do. Up to a one. Hey, it's these those people. It's the old Wait no, that's, that's what Gator said. I thought that was Warwin. That was what Gator said, but anyway, it is the last staring at us. Hmm. I heard from Lucas that you used our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Hmm. Chimchar and Piplup. Dot dot dot. Hmm, I see. Dot dot dot. That's how it is, dot dot dot. Lucas, I'm going back to my lab. Oh, you're, yeah, of course, Professor, wait for me. You should visit us at our lab later, I think. We'll be seeing you. What was that craziness about? I mean, if he was angry, he could have just yelled at us or whatever. And didn't he want his Pokemon back? Cobra, we should go home too. Yes, we just should. Golly, my voice hurts so much right now. What's up, dear? Dot dot dot. Wow, I can't believe that happened to you. I'm ever glad that both you and Gator were unharmed. The professor you mentioned is most likely Professor Warren from Sect. Nim Town. I heard that he is well known for his studies of Pokemon. I hear he's also quite intimidating. Oh, but I think you need to visit him in Sangden Town. You need to properly explain why you had no choice but to use his Pokemon. Don't worry, I'm sure he will well understand. Really though? Oh, I know. Come on, put these on. Got a pair of wanted shoes. Going to Sangden Town is like an adventure in itself, right? With those willing shoes, you can get to faraway places much faster. Okay, let me read the instructions. Tilt the left. Yeah, I know how to do this. I know how to play. I know how to play, Mother. 
Now we can run! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Else, can we pause that all? Oh, I need to figure. Yeah. Okay. This is our menu item. You can see our po what? What? Uh, what? What? I want to check our stats. Chimpshar. Do dos docile. Okay. What's what the ability? Blaze. Is what the power HP is low. Okay. Okay. I believe that's that might just be one of the defaults. But you know, yeah. Okay. We got that. Man. Okay. Now let's head. Now actually, let's head to the next area. Before we also might battle a little bit too, so yeah. Okay, what does this guy say? Okay, stay out. The, basically, he's telling us stay out of the tall grass. I probably won't. I probably won't say every single dialogue because you know my voice hurts. I might let you read it though. I might end up just doing that, let you guys read it instead of having a. Uh, is there anything over here? Found a potion. At least that's nice. Found a secret potion. That's amazing. But yeah, I might let you you guys read it so my voice takes a break from reading every single dialogue. Boom. I might ask, I also might uh, train a little, my chimp chart. I want to train up to level 6. Yeah, home on last. I need, my voice needs to be last up. Uh, let's see what we went into. A Bidoof! The HM slave, basically. Thing is, you actually don't even need, the thing is, in this game, you don't even need HM slaves. Because they give it to you all, all, and everything, so you don't even need them. You just go, yeah, but anyway, but yeah, we're up, tackle! I know, I know, I know what I think what I'm gonna be my first Pokemon to catch will be. It won't be this episode, though, so. But it'll be something soon, though. Oh god, that guy's doing damage! Err, uh, destroy, destroy the Bidoof! Err, uh, yeah! Woo! Fainted! Bye bye, Bidoof! Ooh, did some health, got some health at least. Yeah, hey, I don't know. I don't know how often I'll do that. I kind of wanna. I kind of wanna get to the next level before this guy having health. I think this guy has potions on all white. Yeah, he's giving. He, this guy gives me some white. Pain potions. So we got. We got plenty of potions now. We got how many? We got we got six or four. Cause he gave us like a few, right? Or she gives us a few. Oh, oh he gave us. She gave us like ten. Okay, never mind. I thought she used like three or five. So maybe, maybe I was wrong. We're gonna keep wanting until I get into a Pokemon! Badoof again! Nice. Yeah, I don't, I don't know exactly how I'm gonna cut these out. If I'm gonna cut these, uh, encounters out or not. But, I mean, I might. But, I, obviously, obviously, if the more we train, though, the more we can get the fault, the more we can level up, though. So, oh god, this guy's gonna do some. This, we probably have, we probably will use, have to use the potion now. Alright, how much damage does that do? Oh, can we do one more hit and then we can heal? Or actually, actually we're faster than it, so we don't even have to heal up. Yeah, I might save the potions for later. Because then we can, like, BAM! Nice. I think we leveled up now, right? Yep, we'll level up to level 6, and that gains 2 HP, 1 attack, 1 defense, 1 special attack, 1 special defense, and 1 speed. Man, knowing how good this Pokemon was. And we learned Ember! We learned our first move, Ember! Ember's really good. Well, wait, I mean, well, it's our first fire move, at least. Why? Why? Anyway, we'll make it to Segnum Town already. There's Lucas there. Hi, I've been waiting for you. Please come with me. The professor's waiting to see you. See, this is our Pokemon Research Lab. We'll just go ahead and. Duh! What the? Oh, it's you, Cobra. That old guy, he's not scary so much as he is totally out there. Uh, it doesn't matter, Cobra. I'm out here. See you later. What was that? Your friend always seems to be in such a rush. Anyway, let's go in. What's in here? Don't love that milk, though. Dot, dot, dot. Finally, you come, Kobo. What is it? Let me see that Pokemon again. Dot dot dot. Hmm, I see. This Pokemon seems to be a rather happy. Alright then, I'll give that chip charge to you as a gift. Now, that's yours. Would you like to give it a nickname? Uh, usually I don't nickname Pokemon, but I'm not. Eh, nah. I'm not gonna nick- I don't usually nickname Pokemon, usually. 
Your friend Gator told me what had happened at the lake. I heard you battle every very well despite it being your first time. And from what I can see, there is growing bond between you and that Pokemon, though it is still young. That's why I would like to entrust you with Chimchar, the fire Pokemon. Am I ever glad you toward- Wait, that's Lucas, calm down. If you weren't, well, I don't even want to think about it. Uh, let's move on to the main topic. There's something I want you to do for me. Hmm, my, my name is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want you to know exactly what kinds of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so, it is necessary to collect data using the Pokédex. This is what I wish you to ask you. I want to initiate you with the Pokédex. Well, use it to record data on all the Pokemon in Sinnoh for me. Shall do it. Hmm, good answer. You obtained the Pokédex. That Pokédex is very high-tech in device. It will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. Could I ask you to go everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region? I'll do that. I'm, I got the same kind of Pokedex as you. When you walked up to Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I lived for 60 long guy old. Even now, I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. Now, you should know that there are countless Pokemon in this world. That means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go! Cobra, your grand adventure begins right now! The professor asked me to help, so I'm going to go out and fill the Pokedex pages too. That makes us comrades working together, same goal! I'll teach you stuff later, okay? I love this art style though, this game is pretty amazing. But anyway, that was Professor Warren, what did you guys say? I'm looking- oh, he's looking at his father? Really? Okay. The assistant. Interesting. When he's invented a new Pokedex, but okay. Yeah. Long time a professor from the Kanto region. Professor Oak. They went to the Kanto region a lot. I mean, it's the first, first four generations. It's still in Japan. Hey, Cobra, I want to show you a few things. So follow me. I don't need your guidance. Yes, I know that's a Pokemon Center. This building wide roof is a Pokemon Center. You can get your Pokemon here if you've been here in battle. You found Pokemon in your mission. I'm mocking him because, like, I already know what these are. That's Pokemon. Over here is the building with the blue roof. It's Pokemon. It's a shop where you can buy and sell all sorts of- No, shit. Cool, well, since you're really working pain- I'm not a work, I'm a pro. Don't worry about it, okay? Oh, yeah, right, Cobra. You should let your family know you're help helping Professor One, but together this Pokedex. You may have to travel pretty far, so you should let someone know. Oh, okay. Oh, but first go heal up your Pokemon at the Pokemon Center. You'll be safe then, okay? Be seeing you. You know what? You know I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I'm gonna heal up. Um, what I'm gonna do is gonna heal up my Pokemon, and then go talk to our mother after this. And this is the Pokemon Center. There's no joy. Would you like to waste your Pokemon? Yes, I would. I mean, I only got one Pokemon, so... Bum, bum, bum. Thank you for waiting. We hope you see you again. Talk that, talk to that nice lady that kind of hand here your Pokemon showers. Yes, I know, game. I'm seeing what all these guys, like, people say. The local club is located on top floor of any opening Pokemon set. Is there you can have all sorts of... Yes, I know that. Do you see that PC over there? That's a fancy blue one here. We got... Yep, it's... Where, yeah, basically, it's where we're going to do a po I know, I know a Pokemon. It's Pokemon. I know what, all what to do. I mean, let's go back to our, let's go back to where we need to go. We can go over here. And I'm going to skip the tall grass for now. Just, just for now, though. So we get plenty of training. And let's talk to our mother. There's this building right here. Just let her know that we're going leaving. Welcome home, Koba. Are you and your Pokemon healthy? Yes, it is. I just made dinner. Take a quick rest, dear. Okay, I didn't even need to go to the farm center if he if she heals us. What's up, Cobra? Dot dot dot. Wow, po I should I forgot to do the voice. Wow, Cobra! Wow, Professor won't ask you to do something that big. Oh dear, go for it. Your mom's got your back. Oh, I know, Cobra. I got something that'll be useful. You obtained the guidebook. That won't be that useful. <laughs> you put the guidebook in the keys to item. That guidebook, take a look at it when you're curious about something or have questions. I don't need that, I know. 
Your key, your journey is full of adventure. I envy you, kiddo. Plus, you're not alone. You have your Pokemon with you. I wish I could go instead. I'm just joking, Koba. I'll be all right by myself, dear. So you go and enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things and experience new situations, it makes your brother happy too. Yeah, but please come back sometime. I would like to see the kind of Pokemon you caught, dear. A guy bug, nice. Excuse me, is my little gator here? Oh no, he's not. Oh, then he must have left away. What to do? That boy shouted about going on an adventure, then he bolted. He's so heads headstrong and reckless, and I at least wanted him to take this. No, not to worry, Koba. We'll deliver that to him. What you, Koba? I guess I will. Oh, really? You'll do that for me? Koba, please take this to get him for me. Porcel. The porcel. Oh, yeah, the porcel. Okay. We'll do that. You put the porcel in the bag ski item. Bye bye, Koba. Enjoy your adventure. Let me think. Knowing my boy, he would probably head straight to Jubilife City. Oh, please take that to, to my gator. Alright! Oh, Koba. You're forgetting something important. What am I getting? A nut. Uh, it tame something. Yes, that has always did suit you well, Koba. Now off you go. Alright, what what did we get? Hmm, what only what did we get? About two or one. What wait what did Oh uh, we got the trainer card we also got a trainer card. We got store with eight thousand. Saw all that. That's our ID. Kaboo badges. Obviously we got no badges yet or anything, so but anyway. Anyway, but anyway, let's uh we also got our Pokedex. Also we only got seen we only got Chimchar and uh Starlet, Star, only since Charlie and Bidoof, so you know, we got a lot left to do. But let's actually go this way. Can, can we do it with not running any Pokemon at all? Nice! I love doing that. But anyway, I'm gonna end this episode off here and everything. And I think this is a good ending spot to the very first episode of my new Let's Play of Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. I'll see you guys in the next episode as we head to Jubilee City and everything. But anyway, I've been Green Coach Gaming. Bye bye. Well, I'm out.